Hey there, Odoo users. Today I'm going to be showing you how you can create a refund from the POS. So first we'll navigate to our point of sale app and then you'll enter in the register. So either you'll open up a new session for your register or you can um, continue selling if the register is already open. In this case it's already open and so we can click the refund button right here. This is a functionality that's provided by Odoo by default and automatically it'll show you all of your uh, POS orders. Um, this is a functionality that allows you to refund specifically orders that were made using the uh, POS app. So this is your entirety, your full list of POS orders. Very simply, you can click that POS order. It'll provide you with all of the products that um, are within that order and then you can select the products to refund and set the quantity. So if there's multiple quantities of that same product, you can either refund a lower quantity or the exact quantity that's listed here. So you just need to specify. So let's say perhaps they really enjoy the magnetic board and in this case they just want to return um, or a refund for one of the monitor stands. In this case we'll select the monitor stand, specify one, and then we can see here that it's updated to refund one. The customer is automatically listed here as this is um, a pre-existing order within our system and then simply we'll click the refund button. In this case it'll provide um, the product uh, with the specified price that needs to be refunded and then you can just enter in uh, the desired payment for that refund. So it can either be cash, you can specify um, that you'll be providing the customer with cash um, or you can enter in the customer's um, debit card account if you have um, perhaps uh, like Stripe set up on your environment. In this case we'll just specify cash, validate, and then you can also provide a receipt to your customer showing uh, proof of that return. Um, if we navigate back to uh, this order, so let's go to orders um, and back, let's see Okay, um, and then so the order that we were working on um, is this one. So now we can see here that the refund is now updated um, to one and then it acts as an additional order showing the refunded product. And that's basically it. This is exactly how you create a refund from the POS app. If you have any questions or concerns with anything related to Odoo, we'd be more than happy to assist. Thanks so much for watching.